akili 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 animal alphabet a is for ant b is for b c is for cat d is for duck e is for elephant f is for fish g is for gorilla h is for hippo i is for iguana j is for jellyfish k is for kangaroo l is for lion m is for monkey n is for nightingale o is for octopus p is for pig q is for quail r is for rabbit s is for snake t is for tiger u is for umbrella bird v is for vulture W is for well. X is for ox. At the end of ox. Y is for yak. Z is for zebra. The end. What's that you're holding, Akili? Oh, wow! It's a newspaper, and it has animals on it. Your mother needs to put your sick baby brother to bed. But you can look at the pictures in the magazine yourself tonight, Akili. Meow! <laughs> Shh! Kids, Akili is falling asleep. Akili's friends want her to keep quiet. I wonder why. Oh. Oh, my. What? Shh. It's the animal from Akili's magazine. It has soft fur and pointy ears and a long tail and whiskers around its little nose. What is it? Oh, it's a cat! Cat! The cat went back to sleep. Let's go. accidentally woke the cat up. We all get a bit grumpy sometimes when someone wakes us up. What do you say when you accidentally wake someone up? Sorry. Sorry, cat! Aw, Bush Baby! <gasps> oh, Bush Baby is very scary. 
scared of cats? When your friend is scared, you can help them to overcome their scared feelings. It's okay, Bush Baby. Cats are friends. Be brave, Bush Baby. Okay. Kids, can you help Bush Baby? He's still feeling scared. Maybe he will feel better if you all say hello to the cats together. One, two, three. Hello, hello cats. cats. Meow. meow, meow. Good job, Bush Baby. <coughs> you are so brave. <coughs> <laughs> Well done! You helped Bush Baby feel better! He isn't scared anymore! Yay! Oh, this is so much fun! Bush Baby is pretending he's a cat! Pretending to be cats. Akili. Mother? Oh, Akili. It's time for you to go home. Let's go to the Swoopalulu. Oh my! The Swoopalulu is coming out of the cat house. You'll have to go inside to get on it. Meow, meow. Good idea, Bush Baby. Maybe if you act like cats, the door will meow, open. Meow, 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 meow. I am a cat. Meow. That's Wupalulu. Bye, friends. Bye, cats. Meow. Bye, 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 bye you. It's time for Akili to start her day. But what's that? It sounds like a cat. Today, Akili will play with her new friend, Cat. She will watch him wiggle his ears and stay very quiet while he sleeps in the shade. And then, Akili will go to sleep too and travel to Lala Land where new friends and new adventures await.
tail. Meow, 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 meow. I am a cat. I love to sleep. Meow, 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 meow. Elephant has number five. Elephant trumpet five times. Elephant jump five times. Rajabu and Naomi, and of course the little chicks that she loves to play with. What a fun day filled with play! Akili is really tired, so it's time to go to bed. Good night, Akili. Wow! What an amazing corner of La La Land this is. Something very special must be happening here today. There are so many things to play with. And what a big stage! This must be the La La Land Carnival Ground! Wow. But there is no one here to play with Akili. She should call her friends to come and play with her. Let's think of all of Akili's friends' names and shout them out. Let's start with the small one who makes funny noises. That's right. And what about the biggest one who loves to read? Happy Hippo! Very good. There is one left. The one who wears sneakers and loves to roar. Can you remember his name? Little Lion! That's right. Let's call them here to play. Shout loudly so they can hear you. Bush Baby! Happy Hippo! Little Lion! Hello! Today is going to be so much fun! It's the La La Land Carnival! Oh, ha! Huh. I'm on my Great oh, idea, my Bush friends. Baby! You should invite your friends to join the party! Who do you want to invite first? Oh. Oh, <laughs> and what meow, animal meow, makes meow, a meow, meow sound and has a long tail, a cute face, and whiskers? Cat! Is it a cat, Bush Baby? Uh-huh, uh-huh. Cat! Meow! Uh-huh! Cat! It's a cat! The cute little animal that loves to chase rats and rest in the sun. <laughs> cat! 
Let's use your flying car to find Cat. Then sing him a song to invite him to the carnival. Ah! Oh, What about that? Is that the sound that cat makes? Yes! Maybe if you call the cat, he'll come down from the tree. Cat! Meow! <laughs> oh, cat is too far up in the tree. He can't hear Achille and Happy Hippo calling his name. Boys and girls, can you help call him? Cat! Oh, hello, cat! Well, hello, friends! I am sure that cat wants to join the party. We are going to a party today. We are going to a party today. Meow, meow. Who is that? Cat! We are going to a party with a cat, cat, cat! This is great! Achille, Bush Baby, Happy Hippo, Little Lion, and Cat are all joining the party. Who else could we invite to the party? <laughs> oh, who can that be? I think you need to get in the flying car again to look for this friend that makes the sound woof. Let's go! Oh, Bush Baby oh, sees friend. his friend. But there are oh, lots friend. of animals oh, there. Hello. Goats, chickens, and a dog. Which one do you mean, Bush Baby? Ah, this friend who says woof also loves to play ball. Achille, throw the ball and we'll see who chases it. Oh, there he goes. Is it chicken? Is no. it goat? No. Dog. No. That's right! It's a dog! It's dog! Let's call him over here! Let's make sure we have all our friends on the list! You have to help Bush Baby! When he points to his friend, shout the right name. Cat! Dog! So who's next, Bush Baby? <laughs> <laughs> who's that? Whoa. Get back in the flying car. I'm sure you'll be able to see this friend if you fly <laughs> high up in the sky. that ooh, sound? Is it the gray donkey? No. Is it the zebra? No. Is it the cow? Yes, it's cow. That's right, it's cow. You know what? Let's invite cow to the party. Say his name loud and clear. Cow! We are going to a party with a cat. We are going to a party with a dog. Ooh. Who is that? Cow! We are going to a party with a cat. Dog, cow! This is great! Now that cat, dog and cow have joined you, it's time to celebrate!
Akili. Mother? Time to go home, Akili. The rainbow is just outside the gate, ready to take you home. Whee! Oh, no! The gate is locked again. You have to sing to it again for it to open. We are going to a party with a cat. We are going to a party with a dog. Ooh. Who is that? Cow! We are going to a party with a cat. Dog cow! Yay! <laughs> well done, everyone. This means Akili can go home to her family. <laughs> Don't forget to say goodbye to all your friends, Akili. Bye, Happy Hippo. Bye, Bush Baby. Bye, Little Lion. Bye, Cat. Bye, Dog. Bye, Cow. Bye, Bye Akili. Hi. Akili is back home safe and sound. And it's time to get up. Today, Akili will take a walk in her village and say hello to each of her friends. Then tonight, when the sun goes down, she will be a part of a new amazing adventure in La La Land. Hey, 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 it's the letter of the day. But which letter shall we choose today? Letter Q, 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 letter Q, Q, Q. Show me the letter Q. Everybody say hello, letter Q. Hello, letter Q. Where are you going today, letter Q? Quack, quack, quack. Oh, today, letter Q is going somewhere really cold. Quack, quack, quack. Look at those funny sticks. They will help Letter Q to get to the cold place. But which one should Letter Q pick, kids? Letter Q! That's right! Letter Q should pick the one with the letter Q on. Point to the letter Q. Great job, kids! You found the letter Q. Quack, 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 quack. Wow! The stick is part of a special underwater boat. I'm sure this boat can take letter Q to the cold place. Go somewhere new with the letter Q. Quack, 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 quack. Letter Q and you. Go somewhere new with the letter Q. Quack, 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 letter Q and you. We made it to the cold place. Quack, 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 quack. Brrr. It's so cold here. Letter Q is turning blue. Let's warm letter Q up. Hurry, kids. Get your fingers ready to warm up letter Q. Where do we start? At the top. That's right. We start at the top and then go around and up and down and tick. Letter Q. Quack, quack, quack. Oh, letter Q is still cold. Kids, let's warm him up again. One more time. We start at the top. Then we go around, up, and down, and tick. Letter Q. Quack, quack, quack. Great work, kids. You warmed up letter Q. Now he can explore this new cold place. Quack, quack, quack. <laughs> Those are penguins, letter Q. Quack, quack. Oh, letter Q wants to be friends with the penguins. Quack, quack, quack. Great idea, letter Q. Kids, let's teach the penguins to say quack, 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 just like letter Q. Quack, quack, quack. quack. One more time. Quack, quack, quack. 
Letter Q's new friends are going to take him fishing. Quack, quack, quack. Don't worry, Letter Q. We'll help you catch the fish. Right, kids? Kids, which fish does Letter Q like most? Letter Q! That's right! Letter Q likes the letter Q fish. Kids, point to the fish with the letter Q. That's right! That fish has the letter Q. There's one more left. Kids, can you point to the last fish with the letter Q? Good work, kids! You help Letter Q catch all the Letter Q fish. <laughs> letter Q had so much fun fishing, he wants to take his new friends home with him. <laughs> oh no! The penguins are walking the wrong way! Everybody, say qua 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 to call them back. Qua 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 qua. We did it, kids. The penguins are back. Oh no! Everyone's covered in snow. Silly penguins. Quack quack quack. Oh no! The penguins are walking the wrong way again. Quick, let's call them back. Say qua qua qua. Qua qua qua. Qua qua qua. Phew! The penguins are back. Good work, kids. The penguins love Letter Q's home. Look how happy they are. But now it's time to say goodbye. Goodbye, penguins. The sound qua. The sun has set. It's bedtime now. Oh, Achilles, you're all ready for bed. Aha, uh -huh. your mother has come to read to you. Now, Akili, can you show us where you start to read? That's right, we start to read at the very first letter. And then where do we continue reading, Akili? Um... Kids, is that where we continue reading? Is that where we continue reading? Yes! That's right! We start reading at the very first letter and continue reading to the right. Oh, Achille is falling asleep. Achille is back in La La Land. Oh, what a funny sound. I wonder who that could be. Achille must be somewhere extra special to hear these funny noises. Hello, Achille. Little lion, hello. Of course. Achille is at the farm of... Welcome, Achille. Grandmother Lion. Welcome, 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 friend. Welcome. It's very nice of Grandmother Lion and Little Lion to welcome you to the farm, Akili. <laughs> Thank you! Well done! When someone does something nice for you, you say, Thank you! Grandmother Lion needs your help today. Eggs! Milk! She needs you to collect some eggs and some milk from the farm. Yeah! Rawr! 
I wonder where you'll find eggs and milk. Uh -huh. Akili, are there any eggs and milk in the pond? No eggs, no milk! It's hard work hunting for eggs and milk. Akili, little lion, maybe you need some help? Happy Hippo! Bush Baby! Hello, friends! <sighs> Happy we Hippo won't, won't, and won't, Bush won't. Baby have come to help. What good friends they are! If you all think hard together, I'm sure you'll find the eggs and milk. Hmm. I know. Let's go. Maybe you can find a friend in this field who can give you milk. Kids, can you spot an animal that can give us milk? Cow! Yes! yes. Cow! Oh! Cow! Cow makes milk. That's right. Cow makes milk. That's right, Akili. There's only one cow in this field. She's all on her own. Ooh. No friends. Ooh. Oh, poor cow is sad because she has no friends to play with. And cow can't make any milk when she feels sad. We can help. What a kind idea, Akili. If your friend is sad, you can help them feel better. I know. Friend. Great idea, little lion. You could find Cow a new friend so she won't be on her own anymore. Chicken. Chicken? Yes, chicken. Chicken! You're right! Chicken lives here! And what does chicken lay? Um... Where is Eggs! Eggs! Yes! Chicken lays eggs! Chicken! 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 Chicken lays eggs! La la la! Please. Well done, little lion. It's nice to say please if you want something. <coughs> oh no, poor chicken can't lay any eggs. I wonder why. One chicken! Yes, there is only one chicken here. She's all on her own. No friends, no eggs. Chicken can't lay any eggs when she has no friend to play with because she feels sad. We can help! Great idea! You can help Chicken to feel better! Friend! Yes! I'm sure Chicken will feel better if you find her a friend. Hmm... Who would mm. make a good friend for Chicken? Of course! Cow would be the perfect friend for chicken. Cow! Chicken! Well done, friends! You found a friend for cow and a friend for chicken. And now they are both happy again! <gasps> Wow! Now that she is feeling happy, Chicken has laid some eggs! Ooh. 
Milk! And Cow has made some milk for you too! Thank you, Chicken! Thank you, Cow! Thank you! Well done, friends! It's nice to say thank you when someone gives you something. Let's go to Grandma the Lion! Hello, Grandma the Lion! Milk! Eggs! Oh, thank you, kids! Grandmother Lion is so happy that you helped her to collect the milk and eggs. Akili! Mother? That's right. Your mother is calling Akili. It's time to find the Swoopalulu and go home. Let's go to the Swoopalulu. Roar! Bye, kids! Bye, Bye Grandmother Lion! Lion. Oh. But the Swoopalulu isn't smiling today. He's sad because he's all by himself. We can help! Maybe you can call your new friends to play with the Swoopalulu. Um. Kids, can you help Akili to call her new friends? Cow! Chicken! Cow! Chicken! Ooh. Well done, Akili! And well done, kids! You've called Cow and Chicken. And now, the Supalulu has friends to play with. Akili, the Supalulu is ready to take you home now. Bye, friends! Bye, 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 bye Akili! Akili. Today, Akili will help her mother to collect milk from the cow and eggs from the chickens. And at night, when she goes to bed, another wonderful adventure in La La Land awaits. <laughs> Bush Baby is so excited to draw. Get your paper and colors out to draw with Bush Baby. Today, he wants to draw a happy face. <laughs> okay, Bush Baby, look at the shape of a face. Do you remember the name of this shape? Ooh, can you help Bush Baby remember? Work, Bush Baby. That is a good circle. Now, draw it on your paper. Ta -da! Well done. What should you draw on your face? Can you draw two smaller circles inside your big circle, Bush Baby? <laughs> Bush Baby. Is that where your eyes are? Oh! Aha! Uh -huh, uh -huh. Oh my! What an artist you are, Bush Baby! It's time for your next challenge. Can you draw two ears? That's right! Your face needs one nose. I think a circle would make a good nose. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Very good! Yay! <laughs> <laughs> Bush Baby thinks he's done. Is he done drawing a happy face? Face is not a face without a mouth. Oh, right! This is your biggest challenge so far, Bush Baby. Now you need to draw only half of the circle. Try it. 
Look at that! You have drawn a really happy face, Bush Baby. Wow! Great work, Bush Baby. <laughs> Yay! Bush Baby wants you to draw too. Take a picture of your drawing and send it in to Bush Baby with your name. He'll add it to his... Today is a bright sunny day. The perfect weather to play outside by the pond. Today, Baba Akili is teaching Akili for the first time how to fish with her hands. What a fun way to spend a few hours outside as a family. <laughs> oh, <laughs> Akili is enjoying the ticklish feeling of the fish swimming between her hands. How fun! <laughs> They are too quick and slippery to catch. Akili loves learning different things from her mom and dad. She is definitely going to practice fishing with her dad. And after a good day spent fishing and playing outside, they can eat some of the yummy fish for dinner. It's time to go to sleep now. Good night, Akili. Let your imagination take you far away as you drift off to sleep. What's that noise? It sounds like water. Where did you wake up today, Akili? Oh, wow! It's the magical pond of La La Land. Do you hear that too, Akili? It sounds like someone is crying. They must be sad. Akili! Hi, little lion! Hi, Akili. Look, fisherman! Fisherman? Yes, Akili. He is called the fisherman because his job is to catch fish to sell and also to bring some home for his family to eat. Oh! Fishman! Fisherman! <laughs> exactly, Akili. That's a good way of learning and remembering a new word. Fisherman is sad. But why is fisherman sad? The fisherman has been here since early morning, even before the sun came up. But he still has not been able to catch any fish. If he can't catch any fish, he won't be able to sell anything at the market today. And he also won't be able to bring any fish home to his family to eat. His children love to eat fish. We can, can help! help. La 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 that was a good idea, friends. It kind of worked. The fish came to the surface of the water. But the fish are still too slippery to catch with your hands. Aha! <sighs> <sighs> hmm. uh -huh. I have another idea. Food! Oh, little lion. You have put the grass as food for the fish. If they come up to eat the grass, then you can catch yep. them. That's a very clever idea, little lion. But unfortunately, fish don't eat but grass. Happy Hippo eats grass. Ha! <laughs> yes. Happy Hippo also swims in the water like the fish. But she is not a fish. She eats grass on the land. But fish have their own kind of grass called seaweed and it's inside the water at the bottom of the pond. 
Oh, I can't help. Now I'm also sad like fishermen. Ah, now little lion is sad because he can't help the fisherman catch fish. Aha! Uh -huh. Happy hippo. Good idea, Akili. Since Happy Hippo does swim in the water with the fish, maybe you can ask her to help the fisherman try and catch some. Happy Hippo is happy because she gets to relax outside with her friend Bush Baby and read her favorite book. Woo -woo. <laughs> and Bush Baby is clearly very happy with his book. Why do you look sad, little lion? None of my ideas help fishermen catch fish. Little lion is still sad that all his ideas didn't help the fisherman. Happy Hippo, can you help fisherman catch fish? Well, I can't catch fish. Oh, Happy Hippo has never learned how to catch fish since she didn't eat her food in the water. Oh. But I know someone who can help. Ha! Ah, sometimes on special occasions, Mother Hippo buys some fish from her friend, the fisherwoman. They can go find her and ask for help. Look! Fisherwoman! Oh, there's the fisherwoman! Aha! Uh -huh. Fisherwoman! Exactly, Akili. Fisherwoman also catches fish to sell at the market and take home to her family. Both men and women can fish. Hello, Hello Fisherwoman! The Fisherwoman <laughs> when she shares her fish with friends. For Mother Hippo. <laughs> Thank you, Fisherwoman. Fisherwoman, can you please help Fisherman? The Fisherwoman is happy to help Fisherman learn how to fish with the nets. That way, he can catch more fish to sell and for his family to eat. <laughs> oh Yay! One fish! Akili! It's time to use your imagination to go home, Akili. What a good way Achille. to end a nice day. Goodbye, Achilles. By using her imagination, she can go back to La La Land for more adventures with her friends. Five chicks and a mango. A yummy yellow mango is ripe and ready to eat. One little chick stares at the yummy yellow mango. The hungry chick cannot reach it. Here comes another chick. Two little chicks climb on the chair. They want to reach the yummy yellow mango. But the mango's too high. Here comes another chick. 
Three little chicks ask a mosquito to knock down the yummy yellow mango. Sadly, the mango is too heavy. Here comes another chick. Four little chicks shake the tree, but the branch is too thick and the mango doesn't fall. Here comes yet another chick. Five little chicks sit under a flower, trying to figure out how to get the yummy yellow mango to fall. They think and think, then one of them has an idea. Let's climb on each other, the first chick says. So, the second chick climbs on the first, the third chick climbs on the second, the fourth chick climbs on the third, and the fifth chick climbs on the fourth. They wobble to the right. They wobble to the left. The fifth chick grabs the mango with her beak, but the yummy yellow mango is too heavy. All five chicks fall down. The yummy yellow mango lands on the ground. The chicks giggle and cheer. They get their yummy yellow mango and eat it till their tiny tummies are full. The end. <gasps> Akili <gasps> is so tired. Today, Akili helped her mother cook beans and spinach. And then she listened to stories about her family. And now it's time for Akili to go to sleep. must be looking for her new friends. Do you remember their names? Little Lion! Happy Hippo! Little Lion? Happy Hippo? What should Akili say to greet Happy Hippo? Hello, Happy Hippo! Hello, Happy Hippo! <laughs> Akili is so happy to see her friend Happy Hippo. But where is Little Lion? their friend too. Say hello to your friends. <laughs>
I wonder who could be making such a loud roar. Hello. Father! Father? Father is a very important word. Can you help Akili say it? Father. Father! <gasps> Father! Who are you? I am Happy Hippo! <laughs> now it's Akili's turn. And what should Akili say? I'm Akili. And I am Father Lion. And I am Mother Lion. Mother is another very important word. Let's practice saying mother. 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 Akili loves her mother too. Let's sing a song about family. Lucky today, she got to meet Little Lion's family, and now she gets to meet Bush Baby's family too. But Bush Baby is not alone. There's Bush Baby's father. Can you say it again? And who are they? So now we have learned brother and sister. Well done! So repeat after me. Brother. Brother! And now repeat after me. Sister. Akili! Akili! Who is that? And 
what should Akili say? Who is that? Mother! Mother! That's right. That means it's time for Akili to go home. But how can Akili get home? Rainbow! That's right. They need to find the rainbow. Let's go! Let's run, run, run. Let's run, run, run. Let's run, run, run to the rainbow. Let's run, run, run. Let's run, run, run. Let's run, run, run to the rainbow. Let's jump, jump, jump. Let's jump, jump, jump. Let's jump, jump, jump to the rainbow. Let's jump, jump, jump. Let's jump, jump, jump. Let's jump, jump, jump to the rainbow. But what does the cloud want Akili to say? Can you remind her? Akili to go home. What should Akili say to her friends before leaving? Bye! Bye bye! Bye bye! It's time for Akili to start her day. Today, she will help her mother and her father with work around the house. She will also hug her little brother and she will tell her family how much she loves them. Then tonight, when the sun goes down, a whole new adventure awaits. Bush Baby is so excited to draw. Get your paper and your colors out to draw with Bush Baby. It makes Bush Baby very happy when you draw. Today, Bush Baby wants to draw an animal. Uh huh. <laughs> <laughs> okay, Bush Baby, let's draw a monkey. Should we start oh. with the face? Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Yes, a circle is a very good way to draw a face. Let's give it two eyes, two ears, one nose, one um, mouth. Uh... Good job, Bush Baby. There is so much you can do with circles. Oh, yeah! <laughs> yay, yay! This face needs a mouth, Bush Baby. Can you make a happy mouth? You can try by drawing only half oh. of a circle. Uh -huh, uh -huh. Great work, Bush Baby. Let's try to draw a body now. No, oh, you want to start with a bag? Good idea, Bush Baby. Focus really hard here, Bush Baby, because this part is a little hard. That is a good and straight line, Bush Baby. But I'm not sure it looks like the back of a monkey. <laughs> Let's try again. We can go very, very slowly, Bush Baby. Well done, Bush Baby. Now, can you try and draw the belly? Wow! That looks great, Bush Baby. What else does your monkey need? That's right. Let's try. Good job, Bush Baby. Do you think your monkey wants a tail? Oh, <laughs> yeah. Amazing work, Bush Baby. Now, let's color our monkey. Uh 